Welcome back to Andrew Jean Cleaning. Today I'm gonna show you how to clean up this fridge, make it look like brand new. You all, this fridge, sorry, this is actually a freezer, is like 100 years old. I mean, look at this. We got this second hand from my sister-in-law. And I'm outside here in my garage, so if you hear some outside noises, that is why. But look at this. Let me back up a little bit. Yeah. Seriously, I think this is about 100 years old, but we're gonna make it look brand new. I actually just did a video about how to get the stink out of your freezer, so I will have that linked in the description box as well if it is ready, and then also how to move, remove rust. So that video will be linked in the description box as well. So this is not rust at this point. I got all the rust off, but this is chipped paint, and that's what we're gonna take care of here today. Let me show you the front of the freezer here. Um, this is turned off completely. We're gonna get this looking real nice. I'm gonna take this handle off here in a moment. Let's go to this side. It's gonna be so good. Okay, here are the supplies that we are gonna be using today. I got some gloves and I got some glasses. I got this mask here and then this is going to be our secret weapon. I will have that linked in the description box below but it's the Rust-Oleum Appliance Epoxy, yes? All right, if you do not wanna remove your handle, an idea that I have for you, because I was kind of thinking to myself, did I want to take this off or not, but it's just going to be way easier, is you could just take some Reynolds wrap, cling wrap, tape, or whatever, and you could tape the handle. But if you can remove it easily, I'm hoping this will come off, it's just going to save you a whole lot of headache and heartache. Yes? Yes. All right, let's get to it. Before I get all geared up here, I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do because you may not be able to hear me through the mask. Okay, I got the handle off, came off easy peasy. Loving that. Also, if you are new here, make sure that you hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. This channel's all about cleaning and organizing for busy women. Also, hit me up on Instagram, Andrea Jean Co. I teach women how to turn their passions into profits. So, when I spray this on here, I wanna keep it equal distance throughout when I'm spraying. Like I don't wanna go too close and then go far because then it's gonna be all very textured and it's not gonna look as nice. Also, you wanna keep the can moving as you spray and then just shake as often as you need. I'm gonna show you here, um, and I'm gonna speed it up as I do this once I get all my gear on. Yes? Are we excited to make this freezer look brand spanking new? This like a 100 year old something freezer looking new. I'm ready, let's do it. Okay. You wanna be in a well-ventilated area if you do this. If you are doing this inside your house, see if you can get someone to help you. Get your fridge or your freezer outside because this stuff is potent. But you're gonna to wanna to do a couple coats here, so. I'm also gonna be doing the inside here, so I just wanna give you an idea and you can see it's already on my finger, so that's why it's a good idea to wear gloves. What this process looks like. You can see it's already looking really nice. So I'm gonna finish all this up and I will show you the after. Okay, let's take a peek. Look at how much better that looks. Here we go, just one coat with the epoxy. So it is looking so much better. Let's look inside. My autofocus here has a mind of its own. Look at that. Oh, it is looking so nice in here. So. The epoxy definitely helped. This is just with one coat. I could see maybe here on the other side where we could do a second coat if we wanted to, just to fill some of these excess spots. But this fridge looks like brand new now. Yes, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. Also check out the playlist in the description box below to help you on your own cleaning and organizing journey. Thank you for being here.